Alright, let's pick it up here. We just beat the, uh, certain trials, but now we're gonna head to the boss area. I actually made a dreadful mistake here, uh, but it's okay. I'll explain to you later what I did that was wrong. Now well, that's pretty imposing. Damn, where have I heard that music before? And where have I seen him before? Oh, hey Joachim. Sorry to uh, burst your bubble, but it had to be said. Yep, that's right, that's Joachim. Uh, from Shadow Hearts Covenant and his brother. And, um, what's really interesting is that he kind of explains that the fate that happened to him at the end of Covenant did kind of come true. He, uh, saved the world, he, and he advanced his skills, but he, but as you can see, he was trying to avoid debtors for, a certain magazine, he made the weekly arts by making a sushi shop. Yeah, nice thinking. Oh, that's that's a nice move. After all, he gave you the rose bondage. Oh, I didn't get it in Covenant. Yeah, when you're in a coffin, you probably won't exactly know what what's going on. This is why um, this looks so familiar. It's supposed to be the invisible. So that explains why the people. Why you see people in loincloths and sushi on their heads. Okay. At this point, you actually get to choose which form you want to take. I normally take the, uh, the slim form because I'm good with magic, but I accidentally took the uh, curvy form. And that was my big mistake. Uh, actually, that's kind of implied. You're dumb. Okay. Now, what I should have done is that I was actually trying to specialize myself with uh, special special attack because uh, on her ring, Hilda has uh, special defense down. Brother Joaquin, take your medicine. But in this case, it's not a big deal. I actually discovered I did quite a bit of damage. I think it's probably because they use rage, but oh well. Uh, her physical attack is actually pretty strong. It's like Grand Papillon, it's actually doubled. But the opposite is true with the uh, mask, Slim Hilda. This is why I suggest e equip Crucifix, if not a Leonardo's Bear, because. Uh, what he will do is that attack will actually induce instant death, so that will end your, uh, end this, uh, very quickly. And he uses Rock Crest. And this is the reason why I have Crucifix, because for some reason it cancels out the buffs. Okay, I don't have long to enjoy my stock, so I'm just gonna have to waste it. So his special defense is down, that means his ma weakness to magic increases. Actually, I think I can beat him. He is actually much weaker in Covenant than he is now. Oh well. Okay. Might as well. Okay. Now what are you going to do? Oh, that again. Yeah. At this point, kiss your stock goodbye. I was actually going to use it and weaken his special defense. Use uh, launch him into the air and then Melcrest. Or not Melcrest, uh, Galecrest. Even so... Oh, this will just remove his stock. Or, no, wait, this is Evil Crest. I thought it was Evil Shade. 
but it'll do a lot more damage because than normal because his special defense is weakened. And he gets an extra turn of uh, crap. Yeah, let's see how much health he has. I can take that off. Let's beat him up. That was lucky. What a heavy club. Okay, and he got instant death three and seven key. I think he probably might use it if you're if the battle actually gets really long. Yes, don't get cocky, kid. Oh, right, you were in the coffin, remember? Um, yeah, he was a uh, wrestler's apprentice. And, uh, now the Great Question Mask, which he got from his master, the Great Gamma, he's going to pass it on to Hilda, which will actually triple her uh, abilities. I don't know how much, uh, if it works the same if I'm not, uh, mass curvy, uh, as in this case. Oh, that's convenient. Alright, let's get some tea. And put all this cr weird crap behind us. I didn't know if Slim Hilda had any qualms about wearing it, but I don't really remember. Even so, I think I was lucky now, because uh, Kirby Hilda is much stronger uh, with physical attack and defense. Yeah. And he actually does pay us back for what he for what we did. Let's just talk to him now. Yeah, he does have a real job. He is the lottery chairperson. Uh, I didn't encounter him in Covenant because I didn't find all the lottery members. But in Covenant, you get the ultimate armor, which is... Uh... See, you look a lot like a friend that I used to travel with. I think it's in reference to Yuri, since he traveled with Yuri in uh, the first Shadow Hearts. But anyways, in uh, Covenant, he usually gives you... He gives you uh, Rose Bondage, which is the ultimate armor for Yoki. Yeah, very flattering. But in this case, you get an ultimate armor for Hilda, which is called the Funny Peach. It's really hard to get, just like the Rose Bondage. So I ultimately get it off camera. But we're not done in Rio just yet. As you can see, Joachim is sulking in the corner, staring at a couple of rusted garbage cans. How is a tough guy like you so scared of debt collectors? Are you, they're afraid that you're gonna break their... break your legs? You get a uh, rock crest from him. Yeah, you are quite unfortunate, but... It's interesting how uh, Keith takes it in stride and actually calls him an imbecile. He actually does actively explain to him what imbecile means. Just to prove how dumb he really is. I don't know which is the best member of the Valentines, uh, Keith, Yoki, or Hilda. It's variable. Let's wrap up here and I'll see you later.